Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. Thank you for joining me today. I have a completion. I have two completions for you. And I have a diamond painting that I've chosen for next month for with, paint with friends. Uh, so I want to get to the completions first and then we'll talk about next month with for paint with friends. Uh, I want to take a minute to thank you if you're new to my channel. And uh, if you haven't yet subscribed, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button on your way out. Let me know you enjoyed my completions and what you think of the diamond painting I've chosen for next month. So as you can see, this is the obvious one that I completed. This is from Timu. This is not for paint with friends. I just did it in between. It's a bouquet of roses. I got it from Timu. Isn't it gorgeous? I love it. This is actually going to be a gift for someone special in my life that just recently celebrated a birthday. And um, I'm hoping to give it to her this weekend when I see her. Yes. So, isn't that gorgeous? I love, you know, I was going to change out and use ABs in there. But it's supposed to represent the stems inside the water, inside the vase. So that's what it looks like. So I'm glad I left it the way I did. Because if you put like ABs or something, it won't look realistic. That is real. It looks like stems inside a vase, underwater, which is the way it should be. So I'm glad I left it alone, but look at all those beautiful uh, pink marquees for the pink flowers. I love the purple and I love the yellow. It's just gorgeous. And you know, that is a gift you do not have to water. You can leave it alone and uh, not have to worry about it. Just set it on a counter and never have to water it. That's my kind of gift. I'm not, I'm not a plant person. I actually murder plants. So this is perfect for me, but it's not for me. I'm going to be giving it away. So I'm showing it as a completion so I can give it to the person that it's intended for. And I hope they enjoy it as much as I enjoyed doing it. It's beautiful. I, I'm going to repeat myself. I'm glad I didn't do anything about the stems in the vase because that's the way they should look. They're supposed to look like they're underwater and they're the stems. I'm glad I didn't do anything to them. Tell me what you think and uh, let me know what you think of my flowers. I think they're absolutely beautiful. I love the pink, gorgeous, just love it. And the beautiful uh, green in the middle. All right, my next completion was for Diamond Painting with Friends and that was being hosted by Diamonds and Stuff, Wendy. She was doing Change of Season, and I chose this one. And uh, this was actually a gift that Donna at Diamond Art Joy gifted me last year. And I found the perfect opportunity to do it, and I finished it, and I'm so happy. This is actually my third Diamond Art Club that I completed. So I'm really happy with it. And let's turn it over and have a look. It is Making Friends by Marilyn Casanave. It is a 32 by 32.8 by 32.8 centimeter, 13 by 13 inch. It had 20, uh, 37 colors and it had four ABs. Beautiful. Oh, and there was one fairy dust as well. Uh, it was the W. Where did the W go? Um, I can't remember. It's like a greenish color. It was in the leaves here. In the leaves. A couple spots in the scarf. It was beautiful. Bring it up so you can have a look. Look at the eyes on that cat. Isn't it beautiful? And there were some ABs in there. Beautiful. I just loved it. I had absolutely no problem with this diamond painting. The diamonds went down really well. No problems. I enjoyed every single minute working on this diamond painting. And it was special because it was gifted to me by my friend Donna. So I enjoyed working on it. I came pretty close to running out of diamonds in some instances, but I did not at all. I had plenty to work with. Let me see. So 
don't know how to get away. So I put, I work out of baggies, so I put them in the box there. I've got my pen, got my straightener, got my wax, as you can see. And here are, there's plenty of those ABs left over, the red that went into some of the leaves. And in the, the scarf was like almost full of ABs. There's the second one, the orange, which also went in the ABs. There's a gray, and where's number four? Number four was white. And the white went in the stump of the mushroom and in his face here, in his fur. So that was beautiful. And like I said, I almost run out of some. Came pretty close here with this one. But like I said, I did not run out of any drills. I had more than enough to work with on this beautiful diamond painting. If you follow me, or if you don't follow me on TikTok, please go check me out there. I just put this on TikTok and I try and... Uh, Try and find the right music to go with my painting. Sometimes I succeed, sometimes I don't. I chose the friends theme because they're making friends. I'll be there for you. And that's what they're looking at each other saying. I'll be there for you. We're friends. And uh, it just blew me away. I I really like it. So please, if you're, if you're on TikTok, if you have a TikTok account, go check me out. It's Enzo Diamonds and Crafts. And um, please give it a like. I would love to have your support over there on TikTok. I'm, I also post on Instagram and, of course, I'm on YouTube and a whole bunch of Facebook groups, including Diamond Painting with Friends. So uh, if you are participating in Diamond Painting with Friends uh, projects for each month, please be sure there is a hashtag, Diamond Painting with Friends 2024. Please be sure to use that when you are doing your monthly Diamond Painting with Friends themes. So this was for, um, which one was this? Change of season, season of change. Uh, that was hosted by Wendy at Diamonds and Stuff, and it was a great event. She is currently um, drawing winners for her giveaway. So if you entered that, go and check out her videos. She's on week two. So go and check out her videos. And if you entered, you got to stay tuned and watch. You may win. Um, so there's that. I hope you liked it. Comment down below and let me know you did. So next, for October, Shenanigans with the Bergs will be hosting for October. And her theme will be Candy, candy Skulls. And Halloween slash Halloween. So you can do candy skulls or Halloween themed diamond paintings. And um, she is one of the one of the people that run the Facebook group Diamond Painting with Friends. So if you are not yet a member, please go join us. We uh, we upload pictures there as well, especially if you don't have a YouTube channel. We encourage you to get a YouTube channel if you don't yet. It's a lot of fun and you can show off everything that you do but we understand some people are just you know they they're very shy and they don't want to and you don't have to show your face some people do some people don't so I'm going to show you what I am going to be working on for uh, candy skulls and Halloween slash Halloween I hope I'm saying that right so I'm going to show you might not be I showed it to someone else today, and they said it looks spooky. So uh, I hope it fits with the theme. I did check with Yvonne. I showed it to her, and she said she was all for it. So I'm glad she liked it. It's this one here. It's the pink and the black house with the pink roses. And it looks a little spooky. It looks like overcast, rainy, um... And the black gives it a special effect. It is a 40 by 50. I got this from a company called Diamond Painter. 
I had seen this on Facebook. Someone completed this diamond painting and I had to get it. I loved it. It's a square diamond painting. It has 40 colors. And like I said, it's a 40 by 50. So I'm looking forward to starting this, especially since it's a square. Can't wait to see how this current turns out. So tell me down below and let me know what you think of my choice for October. And my drills come already packaged. I put a label on it so I was able to find them very easily. And uh, yeah, so there they are. There are some ABs in here. Although I don't know, it doesn't indicate which ones are ABs. There's one right there, there's a grayish. But uh, yeah, I can't wait to get started October 1st. And uh, so if you would like to participate, I'm sure there's still time, head on over to Shenanigans with the Bergs, her channel. She will be, I'm sure, putting, putting up a video to start October very soon in a couple weeks. So go check her out. If you're not subscribed, subscribe so you get all the details if you want to be part of Diamond Painting with Friends, uh, Sugar Skulls, it's called Sugar Skulls and Slash Halloween. I'm sorry, I said candy. It's Sugar Skulls. And they're really pretty, these Sugar Skulls. So I can't wait to see everybody's diamond paintings. But this one, I showed it to Yvonne and she was all for it. She was happy. And I it makes me happy because I uh, otherwise, I didn't have Sugar Skulls. <laughs> Um, I would have bought one, but I don't know. It's not my jam. They're pretty. There's lots of confetti involved because I like confetti, but you know, it never, I it was never moved to get one. So I'm glad I have this to work on for the event for, uh, shenanigans with the Bergs, Sugar Skulls slash Halloween. So head on over to her channel, uh, subscribe. And that way in a cut in a few weeks when she makes her announcement about, her event, uh, her diamond painting with friends, you'll be the first to know because you've subscribed and don't forget to hit the notification bell. And every time she puts up a video, you'll know about it and you can keep in touch and also go to the Facebook group. I will link her channel and the Facebook group uh, in the comment, in the diamond, oh my goodness, can I speak? In the description box below. I will also link Wendy, so if you want to go and check out her channel, September's not over yet, um, but you can go and check out, she's done some whip parades, so you can go and check out uh, what people have done. She does it at the end, but watch her whole video. She's got a great channel, so go subscribe to her as well. Well, that's my video. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed my choice for October. My completion from Timu and my completion for Diamond Painting with Friends Season of Change, hosted by Wendy at Diamonds and Stuff. Thank you for coming by. Thank you for watching. Please give a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and if you haven't subscribed yet, I would appreciate it. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified every time I upload a video. And I will see you. If not before October 1st, October 1st, so we can kick off putting on the first few diamond painting, the first few diamonds for this diamond painting. So I will see you October 1st or maybe sooner. Who knows? Thank you for watching, everybody, and have a great day. Bye.